Hi and welcome to this video brought to you by Blueberry. My name is John Kibler, Senior Market Analyst. Over the weekend we saw oil prices gap lower. This was down to Israel retaliating back to Iran's previous attack. Oil prices gap lower because Israel avoided energy supplies and facilities when launching the attack on Iran over the weekend. Iran provide around 3% of total world production but the biggest buyer of Iran's supply is China. They take up 90% of Iran's supply, which does give China an active interest in the ongoing conflict. Now, taking a look at hedge fund sentiment at the moment, hedge funds are selling oil. They're not doing it at levels of extreme, which makes me think that prices can still continue to drive slightly lower, which is interesting considering a lot of retail traders will probably see this gap at the moment and think there's a good opportunity to buy oil to close the gap because that is a very popular trading strategy but just bear in mind gaps don't always close straight away now seasonally oil price is actually bearish as well through october to early december we usually do see oil prices fall to the downside but what we have to take into consideration here is what oil is reacting to at the moment and it's reacting to positive data or positive announcements via israel versus iran and the fact that israel are not attacking energy facilities this could change obviously war is war and if iran do retaliate then that is a big risk to oil and oil prices will likely drive higher if they do retaliate that being said the price of oil is trading around 66 dollars and 75 cents at the moment which is a key area of support in the near term we could see a small rebound from this area however we could see these rallies being met with strong sellers in the very very near term until we start to see a big reversal coming in via those hedge funds so in summary, oil prices have moved because Israel did not attack the energy facilities in Iran. We also know that oil is bearish in terms of hedge fund sentiment and also from a seasonal standpoint. Now, please remember, this is just a trade idea. Please do your own due diligence and research and risk appropriately.